it is a massive setback for Karti Chidambaram in the Aircel Maxis case as the case haunts Karti. Uh, the ED has conducted raids in both the Delhi and Chennai residences in connection with the Aircel Maxis case. The residences of Karti Chidambaram being raided as we speak. In fact, the raids are being conducted in the residence both in uh, the national capital and in Chennai. We are given to understand that the raids have be, are being conducted by the Enforcement Directorate in in connection with the Aircel Max's case, case earlier as well, Karthi Chidambaram had refused to present himself after summons were issued to him as far as the Aircel Max's case is concerned. And now, fresh race being conducted. Nikunj Garg, Senior Editor, Internal Security, joining us on the phone line. Uh, Nikunj, can you give us a, uh, a background of what really these raids are all about? Well, this is uh, ASL Ubisoft's uh, subsidiary case that the uh, Enforcement Directorate had lodged after the Central Bureau of Investigation uh, that has been sold in this case from the uh, coercion point of view, from the FIBB clearance point of view. We have to keep in mind that the original ASL Maxis case, which said that the Maran, particularly the Anity Maran as telecom minister, uh, coerced applied pressure on the original owner of the ASL in Singapore to sell off his company to the Maran brothers has been discharged, has been dismissed by a trial court. But nonetheless, the offshoot of those cases, which is the beginning of this case when the FITB has that, uh, that means uh, the Foreign Investment Promotion Board clearance was provided, and when Karthi Dhamparam's father, Mr. P. Dhamparam, was the finance minister of the country, that case continues to uh, be probed by both the CI and the enforcement director because there are allegations that that FIT clearance was also uh, wrongly granted and there were some payments of illegal gratification. Remember, those are only in the realm of allegations and both Mr. Chidambaram and his son Karthi have, uh, you know, very robustly contested those elections and have said that there was a procedure in place. FITB, as you would know, is now defunct. The government of India has disbanded. The Narendra Modi government has disbanded FITB in under the new dispensation. Nonetheless, uh, CBI had done Karthik Dhamra on multiple locations, at least on one occasion, we did uh, uh, move for, uh, attended uh, CBI summons. The enforcement director had right. also summoned him uh, on um, other occasions, but uh, there has been some contest from both sides okay. about the nature of the summons. And uh, Karthi has again gone to the Supreme Court saying he needs to travel abroad. Nonetheless, uh, this time the rates are coming in the ASL Max's case. In Delhi, at least, his residence at Zorbaz. Uh, in right. New Delhi is being raided and at least And in fact, uh, Nikunj, the residence that you're talking about, we are bringing to our viewers exclusive visuals of that uh, residence in the national capital of P. Chidambaram, Karthik Chidambaram. On your screens are those exclusive visuals from the Delhi residence of uh, Karthik Chidambaram.